Hey everybody, it's me Jamie. I thought I'd make this video for you guys just to kind of tell you what happened. Um, I know we are all striving for diamond and I want to te tell you <laughs> what happened to me in hopes that it doesn't happen to you. Um, I call this my road back to diamond. I worked so hard to build the right number of coaches on each side and kind of convinced a couple coaches to sign on coaches so that I could be diamond. And then I was diamond and then I was like, okay, nobody go inactive for six weeks so I can be lifetime diamond. So I was like stressed out for the whole six weeks and, you know, and just focused on not losing my diamond rank. And then I'm lifetime diamond. So I'm like, sweet, I'm Lifetime Diamond. But what I wasn't doing is I wasn't building my diamond business with a solid foundation. I wasn't building it on my team and helping my team succeed and implementing a system and procedures and strategies to help them to be successful. I was only thinking about myself. That's kind of a hard thing to admit. It's a really hard thing to admit. So I was really only thinking about myself. And it wasn't until I started to think about what I could do for the team and forgetting about being paid diamond because then I didn't realize that if if an emerald loses rank then you lose rank your paid rank you still get the lifetime status so when I went to summit I got my diamond medallion but I was a paid emerald I wasn't a paid diamond I didn't feel like a diamond I didn't feel like a diamond so you have to realize that if you're in it just for yourself and your own success, you are going to end up building your diamond business on shaky ground. And I want you to build it on solid ground. So some tips for you um, as you're building your business and your team is to structure your team so that you are building a solid foundation with, with the people that you want to work with and the people that aren't just discounts coaches. You want to talk about the business as a business in your social media. You want to share the business opportunity as not just a way to make money, but as a way to improve your life, as a way to improve the people around you's life, as a way to inspire people and help people. Because as we know, you don't get rich in the beginning. <laughs> You don't get rich with this business right away. This is a long-term situation, and this is a growth, a personal growth, and a way to, to help people and a way to inspire people and, and all of those things. And it's not a way to get a Lexus and a way to get a quick $1,000 bonus here and there because those businesses, they fail, and they fail quick because – you can't sustain that and, and your focus is on the money and it's not on the people that you're working with. Where Beachbody's different, we focus on the people first, not the money. And when you do that, when you really focus on not just your challengers, but your, your coaches as well and, and doing things to set up your systems and your procedures and everything, your your way of training them and way of supporting them and, and structuring that in a way that is duplicatable. And you've heard this many times. This is not something new. It's not the first time you're hearing this. But if you have a system that is duplicatable or duplicable or however you say that word, um, then you will see start to see your new coaches coming on board reaching success faster than you did. So I just encourage you to think about it and to not think about just getting to diamond because you could lose that diamond status and that could be a real, that could be a, a momentum killer for you and for your business and you could quit because you could be like, well, I lost diamond. Well, guess what? You still got coaches and challengers that are, are waiting for you and that need you and need your support. 
So focus on the people, focus on your team, and focus on working together and building a culture within your team and, um, and helping each other and really working together to grow and, um, and grow together. So it's all about being stronger together and working as a team. And I just can't thank you guys enough for inspiring me and I just keep watching you guys and I am in such awe by your stories and your transformations and everything that you guys are doing in your heart and soul. It's so amazing to me and I'm so blessed that um, I I came across this opportunity and and that I, I took the, the leap of faith because I would never have met you guys and I would never have had my team. And I'm just so, so, so blessed that we're here together and I, I want to do whatever I can. So that said, to help you, whatever I can help you. That said, I have been working on my training site. So Steven does an awesome 21 day um, new coach training. So that is where you guys should be sending your coaches if you're not doing your own 21 day new coach training. But if you need extra support and you need a, a place to send them, so let's say the next 21 day training isn't for like another month and you have somebody that wants to get started right away and you want to give them some structured training. I don't know if you're going to like it, but I'm putting I've put together a training website. I still have two more videos to post, but I will get those posted. <laughs> but if you need something to send them to that's um that's kind of structured instead of just saying, okay, go to the back office or or go to YouTube or whatever, um feel free to send them to my training website. I don't know. Hopefully you like it. I'm not sure if you like it, but I just want to that's one way I guess I can help give back to you guys. So anyway, I'll get off here now. I just love you guys so much and I just want, I want you guys to never experience losing your diamond rank like I did because <laughs> it sucks. I'll be honest, it sucks. So I'm just so appreciative of my team, of you guys. Um, I cannot wait, cannot wait to continue working together with you guys and supporting each other and watching you grow and being at Summit with whoever's going to be there because if you're not going to Summit, you need to figure out a way to get there. Um, but anyway, so, okay. I love you guys. Mwah. Bye. <laughs>